A good Erev Shabbos, as we learn the Mishnah Yaimis for this Erev Shabbos of Parashas Kitzetze. Remember, women who didn't fulfill the mitzvah of uh, Zechim Mechia Samalek can do so this Shabbos. We are sponsored by the Fisher family, the Lishnas Basi Bas Rabbit, Shama Ben Avram Alevi, Peril Bas Ruvain. We're also learning the Lishnas David Ben Chaim, the Fush Lam Felio Mash Bechai Sar, for the Schuss of Avram and Yom Ben Shmamak Yehudis. We're learning sponsored by Yol Klugman and family for their Panasik Zontanachas, the Fush Lama for Mayor Ben Achai Sar. You should have a Fush Lama Besech Shar Chili Yisrael. We are in the final Perik of Bava Kama the 10th parak, and uh, we are holding by uh, Mishnah Hey uh, Mishnah Dalin and Hey so Mishnah Dal tells us Zeba B'chavita Shal Yain if Ruvain was coming with a jug of wine V'zeba B'chavita Shal Dvash and one is coming with a jug of honey honey was more expensive than wine Nistaka chavi shel dvash, if the uh, jug of honey cracked, v'shafach zeis yenoi, and Reuven quickly spilled out his wine, v'hitzelas ad vash l'soichai, and saved his friend's honey, he can't, Reuven can't ask for him to replace his wine. Ein lo yalaschorai, he only gets for his time that he went and use of his jug, but he can't ask for the wine, because Shimon didn't ask him to spill out his wine. However, the Omar Atzel Eshel Ha, if he says, look, I'll save your honey, but but you're going to pay me for the wine I'm spilling out, and Shimon agrees, then then he has to pay him. Similarly, if a flash flood comes and sweeps away Ruben's donkey and Shimon's donkey, the Chamor Chaveirai, Shaloi Yafaman, Ruvain's donkey is worth a hundred, Vishal Chavera Masayim, Shimon's donkey is worth two hundred. So in Niach Zeh Shaloi, Ruvain lets his donkey drown, Vihitzel Eshel Chavera, and he saves Shimon's more expensive donkey, Eino Yalaschorai. He only can get paid for his time. He can't ask him to pay him the hundred dollars for his donkey. However, Vihim Omalai, if he tells him, Look, Ani Atzel Eshel Cha, I'll save yours. But because I'm not saving mine, you have to pay me for mine. And Shimon says, okay, then of course Chayv Litenlo has to give him the $100 uh, for Shimon's, for Ruvain's donkey. Now, let's say Chatzkel uh, pushes Ruvain out of his field and, and, and steals his field. And then, after Chatzka pushes Ruvain out of his field, then uh, uh, wild Goyim come and take over the field. In Makas Medina, if this is happening to a lot of people's fields, then uh, Ruvain can't claim that Chatzka should replace the field. You could say, look, here's your field, take it. Because Karka ain't an exelus. Karka is not stolen. However, the Imachmas HaGazlan, but if the, the marauder uh, only started up because now it was in the hands of Chatzkel, which Shimon, he wouldn't have started up. But since Chatzkel is a wild guy anyway, he took it from Chatzkel, then Chayiv Lahamad Loi Steyacher. Then, then Chatzkel has to uh, uh, give uh, Ruvain another field because it was taken away because he misappropriated Shetofanar, if Chatzkel pushes Ruvain out of his field and then it was uh, destroyed by a flash flood, Aymeloi could tell him, Harishal Cholofanecha, because it had nothing to do with the fact that Chatzkel took it and Karka is not stolen. We want to thank you for joining us. Motsi Shabbos, Daf Yomi is at 9.30 at zoomdaf.com, meeting code 914408, and have a wonderful Shabbos.